morning everybody ron and i are out here bright and early this morning and we struck gold out here on the beach we wanted to show you um, that it's hatching season right now the babies from our sea turtle mamas are coming out of their nest and we were fortunate enough to happen upon a nest that had just had some some new escapees out of it this morning so if you look down here we get to show you what the uh, turtle patrol is looking for and what you can look for when you come out onto our beaches in the morning. Now, first thing we're going to say is don't, if you see little tracks or you see that there's a hole in the nest, stay kind of, so you see how I'm to the parameter here? I'm not in front of the nest because I want to show you all of these tracks here and I, so far the turtle patrol hasn't been here yet and so we don't want to disrupt that area because there's different things that they need to report on. So we're going to stay to the outside um, away from the tracks. So if you look down at the nest, you'll see that we have a great hole here. Yay! That means babies have erupted here. Looks like we had probably about three of them that came out. I'm counting the, the tracks out here. So, but we also, if you look over to the right side of this, you'll see there's another little indentation there. That means it's starting to, somebody's getting interested down there. What happens is they start real deep. Remember we talked about last time, they could be about 20, 21 inches down, um, those eggs. And when they hatch, they're going to start climbing out of that sand. And it's, it can take them a couple days. They could be down there for as good as a week trying to come out of this nest. So once they finally erupt, of course, this is kind of a disruption of that sand. They're pushing it away. So that's where you're going to get those divots. You'll see that we have some tracks that have come out. And you see one, two, three sets of tracks. And you're looking for, remember when we looked before, we, I said they look like a tractor that comes up out of the water and comes up onto the ground um, when the sea turtle mamas come out. Now you get to see the little miniature side of it. You're seeing that still that V formation from those little flippers that are working so hard to get them out to the sea. And I was really excited. Um, I have good news on this one because sometimes they don't make it all the way out there. The ghost crabs, remember my, my ghost crabs, will come out and they'll have a midnight stack. Well, it looks like these all made it out. I already tracked them all the way down to the rack line, and it looks like we're good to go. We got at least three babies that made it out to the water last night. So, yay, that's magical. That's just awesome. What we do on a sea turtle patrol is we will open up a nest after three days after we have a known hatch. So once we know these babies are starting to come up, we'll give them three days, and then we do what we call a nest excavation, and we will come out and we'll open up the nest. And when, why, the reason why we do that is we want to make sure that any stragglers that are in there that we're releasing them out because by that time they're getting pretty tired and we want to make sure that they're getting out there. But we also then look at all the eggs and we try to piece the eggs actually back together. Um, just count how many uh, hatchlings we have. Hi, I'm Mary Sheridan and this is Pat Dowie. We are with the Sea Turtle Patrol here on Hilton Head Island. What we have just done today is a nest inventory. Three days ago, this nest hatched naturally, and our permit from the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources tells us to go in three days later and find the contents and record the data of the contents of the nest. So out of this nest this morning, we had nine live hatchlings found. Many were trapped in the roots, so they were uh, a little disadvantaged going into the water, but hopefully they'll survive. That's how it kind of works. That's kind of the, the whole, you've got the whole story of the sea turtles here on Hilton Head Island. We started out, we were talking about those mamas rising out of the water, and now those babies are heading out to sea. Once they get out there, what are they doing? Well, they're trying to make it out there to the Sargasso Sea, and sometime I'll tell you all about that on another video in the future. For now, happy birthday little turtles, and it's great talking to you all again. See you soon. Bye-bye.